right, ready? Uh, what's the month for this one? This is October. It's November. I know, they send it in the middle of the month. Hello friends, and welcome back to another episode of Birdie Curds. You know what it is, because we've been doing it for so many times, but we're gonna unbox this bitch and eat the stuff inside. We try these snacks every month. Veggie, Virgie, vegan cuts. That's what it's really called. We just call it Virgie curds, whatever. It is a snack subscription service and they send really awesome vegan snacks that you could find at the grocery store. If you happen to see it there, there are some fun snacks. With fun people like Amanda. Amanda's definitely a fun person. If you haven't met her in real life, well, I suggest you go meet her in real life. Hold on a second. Enjoy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Enjoy four to you and her friend. Rice chips made by Lundberg. I feel like we've had these. We've before. had Lundberg rice chips before, but never the sriracha flavor. Sriracha. The correct spelling is an R and an IR in the middle. We're going to be cracking into these. It's made of brown rice, believe it or not. And brown rice has all these properties. And the best way to present these is just a. Like a fan. Card fan. Chip fan. Toast me. Mm hmm It's not spicy until the very end. You know what would be really good? Guacamole. Yeah. It's so thick. Yeah, it's like a, thick chip. a guacamole that's not spicy though. I mean, really. Perfect with this. This is nice. This is nice. What do we rate it? I, I want to give it... I'm going to give it four double chins. If you're new here and you're not aware of the double chin rating system, this is so. This is the first layer, and this is the second layer. This is a full double chin. Now, when you're getting four out of five double chins, you're getting that's a pretty much a what a B. That's a B. It's a B rating. That's but pretty good. Let me kind of break that down. Is that that's how many chins I would receive from eating as many of these as I could. That's the best way, honestly. So, I mean, it's hard it. to really. I mean, I would eat so many of these that I would get eight double chins. That's crazy. No, eight regular chins. Eight regular chins. Like eight more on top of. And on top of this one chin. Like just imagine like adding more. More from eating these. That's and that's the. That's a lot chin. of chins, guys. It's really all about exaggeration, but there's some truth behind exaggeration. There is. Like there there's is. truth behind the Benitos. We get these. Pretty much every single vegan cuts <laughs> box, so it's not really like something we've never tried before. We but should call it Benito's cuts because it's <laughs> like that. But even though we get these every box, they're super good. Boom! I get them every time. Eat them all the time. Eat them. Perfect. There's no like flavor to it, so it would be really good with salsa again or guac. Whatever you want to put on it is gonna be really good. It's a solid four. It's a four double chin every time. It's, it's, an, it's an original. I'm already gonna give this five. Honestly, pit One, corn, the baby two. corn. I'll just let you do it. I'm I just doing, I mean, pit. I love these. As seen They're on like Shark tiny. Tank. Here, let's show them. Let's show them. It's gotta come from the sky. Because it's like mana. It is. Look uh, at how cute and baby these are. So why don't like, they have these at movies? That's what I wanna know. They make a killing at movie theater. Yeah. It's, and kettle corn. Where? It's just small enough to block a child's air passage. Mm hmm Just small enough. Which makes it dangerous. Which makes but it extra just, flavorful. Because danger is the flavor of life. <laughs> <laughs> danger is not the flavor of life. Oh my gosh. I don't even want to open this because I want to eat it later. It's a protein cookie called Monk Pack. I mean, they're trying to go up against Lenny and Larry. Lenny and Larry's and all the other cookie companies that have protein in it, which is a lot if you go to Whole Foods. Go ahead, I'm gonna break it down. Here. Okay, so each cookie has 360 calories, which is pretty close to Lenny and Larry's. I think Lenny and Larry's has 400 calories per big cookie. 18 grams of protein. How many does Lenny and Larry's have? 16. You got a good amount of carbs, 32 grams. That's not bad. It's a cookie with protein in it. It's something that you would probably want to eat on the go. Shouldn't it be part of like the regular diet? Like you shouldn't just have cookies all the time anyway. Unless it tastes really good. Boom. Look at that profile though, guys. 
You're getting a whole bunch of layers on layers on layers. Ooh, ooh, and there's little white chocolate chunks in there. Mmm, it's dry as fuck. Look how good it is. It's so dry. It's good, but we need a drink. Mm. It's not that dry. I'm exaggerating. It has some moisture to it. It's tasty. I think that extra two grams of protein that just, this cookie boasts. It just pulled it out. It's not chalky. If Which you don't I really like, appreciate. If you don't like a cookie that's like super moist, like a lot of, some people don't like that kind of cookie. Yeah. Then that's what you're looking for. It's vegan and especially because it's gluten free. Mm. Good. I give it a four, honestly, for a protein cookie. I'm gonna, give me, I'm gonna give it three double chins, but I feel like there are other cookies, namely a peanut butter cookie, would probably receive a four or a five. Unsweetened guava tea, guayasa tea. Cool, cool. There's absolutely nothing in here. It's just fruit organic goyasa. Guay USA, actually. From the Amazon. Ooh, I like this. It reminds me of black tea that people would mix to make boba milk tea. That's what it tastes like to me. It's unsweetened, but it's sweet. It tastes like tapioca. It's insanely right? sweet, yeah. Put a lid oh, on it. Guys, get that. For get this, it. honestly, I give it a five. For this drinks, it's gotta be the gulp. Do it with me. Anyways, there's five of those. And Next. my favorite thing to drink oh. after tea is more tea. So this is tea chino. I've tried it before, but it's basically just a kind of tea that mimics coffee. So if any of you guys are trying to get off coffee, you can make the tea, kind of taste like it. I recommend I have some at home. This is new. This is really new. It's so, I don't know what it is, but it has a It's snack unreal. On it. Or is it just by itself and the toy? The toy is just by itself. itself. Wow, we got a it's... toy this time. Shout out Jasmine's, to Jasmine's boyfriend, boyfriend Chris for hooking it up with the freaking Fuck. bracelet. Boy, you are you're just upping your game. Not right only now. are you feeding us with your delicious snacks, but you're also putting the clothes on our backs. It's <laughs> health. That's a, what. So this is safeguarding kids. Kids wear this at school or just around so that people know that they're vegan. That's cool. Well, doesn't fit my wrist, so I guess kids are not gonna know that I'm vegan. But if a kid was wearing it, I'll know that they're vegan, so get with it. I give that up. Um, Latex free. I mean, I can't give this any double chance. Stop, what, why? Uh, it's gonna get a half double chin. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it, you know, it tastes okay, but dang, we're getting some crazy Wait, stuff Wait, what was here. that Unreal thing that was in there? I was saving that for later, oh, but okay. I would just want to tell you guys it's good. It's a peanut butter, chocolate peanut butter covered Of thing. course you're saving it for later. It's, I don't want to open it, take a bite, and then not have it for later. I want it for later for sure. I want to try okay, it. Okay, just... Come on. Ooh, it's so good. Five <laughs> double chins. Please, double sir, chin. please. <laughs> All right, why don't we try a different one that's probably the same thing. It's, it's super probably hip. not. Mini Jimmy Bar. Super hip chocolate, chocolate chip. chip. Petites de chocolate. Oh la, oh, la, la. la. When hipsters start a label company. That's what happens. It's like there's dates in there for sure. Oh, just like a snack bar. Yeah. Under 100 calories. Yo, there's a lot of good stuff happening here today. Soft baked minis. These are a go-to for normal vegan cut snacks. We love these. Snickerdoodle, great flavor. I think we tried it already. We tried it so many times. Check out the links above and to below. the side, and maybe there's some below. There are some snacks that we're not gonna put together and try, but I just wanted to let you know that we do receive like full size and also sample size things. Next thing that we're gonna try is gluten-free granola. Gluten-free granola. It's a cranberry almond ma maple flavor. There's so many things happening yeah. here. Oh, I mean, it looks like corn chips. It looks like corn flakes, to be honest. Corn chips. Corn I would eat this. I it's getting some double chins right now. I'm gonna give it three. It's a new flavor. It's just good alone. Like it's yeah. a clean flavor. It's, it's not, a good snack. It's not too sweet, not too salty. Figgy that. Pops, Choco Crunch, Super Snacks, Organic Fruit, and Nut Snack. All right. There it is. These are winners. These are good. Ooh, I like them. Me too. Delicious. Yeah, I give it five. Easy five. Easy five. I'm not even gonna do them. They're five. Great snack. Next snack we have are these fruity gummies. Let's just, let me just double check that there's no, yep, there's no um, gelatin. Gelatin, perfect. That's what we're looking. It's hard to find a non-gelatin 
gummy snack on the shelf. Oh, these are actually like gummy bears. Amazing gummy bear, little gummy snacks. Are they snacks. gummy bears? Fruit snacks. The fruit snacks, oh my gosh, I love and there's no high fructose corn syrup. A lot of good flavors. In it. Big ups to their free coupons. Look at that. Just in case you didn't get enough snacks in your box, you get a free bag of Benitos. Like you get a free extra five double chins. Get it. Sea salt and almond chocolate. Taza chocolate. You know you if you guys you're... know how I love our chocolate. 80% dark stone ground chocolate. Ooh. When it's that time of the month and you need a go-to. The darker the berry. The sweeter the, sweeter the, the juice. juice. Except there's no juice in this. It's and actually it's, chocolate. It's not a berry. But it is very good. <laughs> Hi, Lolo. <laughs> Alrighty. Special guest appearance. You want some chocolate, Lolo? I don't think so. Try for you and a try for me. Boom, cheers. Oh yeah. Mm. I don't like when it's like up in the 90s. I don't like when dark chocolate's up in the 90s. So this is a perfect sweet spot for me. And Tiles of chocolate, you did it again. The almond chunks aren't too big. Just enough for a crunch. I think it's a, I think it's a winner. If there's one more thing that we didn't try. There is nothing else. <gasps> there's one more thing we didn't try that I really just want to try. Grab it. It's my only peanut butter cup. Please. See, I'm only going to take a little bite. Me too. You're going to eat the whole thing. Yeah, but. Five double chins. Mm-hmm. I love peanut butter. I love chocolate. I eat it when anyone's on their period. That is the Vegan Cuts box for the month of October. I know it's November right now, but we got busy schedules, so it's just hard to find time to coordinate. Anyway. I'm Amanda's brother, Fred. I'm Fred's sister, Amanda. And thanks for tuning in to... Virgie Curves. Hey, baby. I hope you're having a wonderful morning, noon, day or night, wherever you are. And if you're interested in vegan cuts, make sure you check out the links and all the fun words in the description below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Yeah, and hope you guys liked it, like you actually liked it. And I'll see you next time. Bye.